Hey guys, welcome to another Hitman 3 video. Today we're in Holiday Hoarders going for the Santa's Little Helper Challenge. So we got to steal 12 items before Harry and Morib. So we're going to start undercover in the AV Centre as a tech crew, take our gold bullet and a lockpick. Let's get into it, shall we? So the reason we're starting in the AV Centre is because we can instantly steal an object once we start. So you want to skip and you want to steal this remote here and that is your first object. Next, run back on yourself and through these double doors, and you just want to run past these. You want to put this in your pocket and run, and you want to go just down here, and you want to knock out Marv. Actually, I think this one's Harry. So, you want to knock out Harry. You want to just drag him so he's behind this desk, nice and neat so no one can see him and then you want to pick up this and this just in case next we're going to run down to the basement and we're going to go take out Marv so this is the easiest way to do it as then we're not constrained to time limits on stuff you could do it without the time limit and it's actually quite easy so we're going to run right past him and we're just going to subdue him. And then we're going to drag him around here. And into this room here. So you want to pick up his crowbar and then we can start taking the items. So item number two is the coconut just on this shelf on this side here item number three is the apricot in the kitchen which is just here item number four is a toy is a shuriken sorry so we're gonna steal a shuriken which is just up these stairs turn to your right and down this hallway and as you can see, just on this little dress here, there's a shuriken. Steal it and run down here quickly to not get seen. So, item number five is not the battle axe. We're going to leave that till last. Item number five is a toy tank. Still no answer. So, you want to go through here where you distract this woman and you want to take this tank. This is the same room as you give that woman the uh, camera or microphone. And instead of going out through there like I was going to, you want to just go through these double doors. And then through these double doors. And you want to take the cannonball that's just in front of this ship for item number six. So let's just count one, two, three, four, five, six. So item number six done and then we can head upstairs now so we're gonna go up here and we're gonna hang off this side here so this is where we took out Marv sorry Harry we're gonna go back in here we're gonna shut these doors and shut these ones and we're gonna go right to the back. So once we're here, we're just gonna get our gold bowler out. I'm gonna take this camera out, just in case we can walk past it later. So we're gonna go down here and into here. At the back of this room where this tree is, you'll find a knife just here. And that is item number seven. So item number eight is up in the attic. So we jump out this window here where all these waiters are and we scurry along the side of the building. So once we're done here, we're gonna climb up. And for item number eight, there is a bust in the attic security room. So to get to that, 
going to pick these scissors up and throw them here to distract this guy. We're not going to pick them back up. Man, thought I heard something. Checking it out. Over. So once he comes to check it out, we're going to subdue him. We're going to leave his gun for this woman to find so that she doesn't come instantly around this corner. I'm going to drag this guy all the way down here. We're going to leave him just by these uh, boards here. I'm going to take his disguise. Pick up his gun so that no one comes around the corner now. And go through these Dahlia's office and then through these double doors and through these double doors into the security office. So here, we're just going to wait till this guy moves. And we're going to go here, and we're going to take this bus. So item number 9 now is the sabre just past here. So we took the bus there, it's literally just here. We can put this away and not get noticed, drop our gun. So item number 10 now. We're moving on to the cowboy bust, which is just at the end of this hallway in this little room over here. So past these two guards. And into here, and the cowboy bust is here. So item number 11, which is basically near enough the final item that we're going to find, because we've already found the battle axe. And it is the Branson M2 microphone. So we're going to go up the other side of the attic. And just where this present is near enough, we're going to find a hammer and there is a microphone. So now we need to go get item number 12, the final item. So what we're going to do is we're going to go all the way around here. And we're going to go back through and jump down the way we came up. So we don't get spotted by any guards that will notice us. So, we're going to jump right back down here. And we're going to hang off here again. And then we're going to climb in through the window with the servants, not this one. Sorry, the waiters. Not servants. <laughs> so, we're going to climb in through this window. I'm going to wait till this guy moves. And we're going to go around him. So, we're going to go right around here. And like I said, this is why we took out the camera. Through here. And then down this stairwell here. So, we're going for item number 12 now, guys which is the battle axe in the bar area. So, go right around here. And here it is, guys. There is item number 12, just in this ice here. So, you can pick this up, normal notice, and there you have it. There is the holiday, sorry, Santa's little helper challenge. Now, if you want, you can kill Harry and Marv, and do another challenge but we're just gonna end it there guys so i'd like to thank you all for watching if you enjoyed please like subscribe and tune in for another hitman free video very soon thank you goodbye